living the good life here with a garage sale and thrift store finds video for Friday, June 12th. Wanted to show you what I got. I was hopeful that I would have two weekends in a row of great garage sales, but this is going to be a short video. So I went to tons of garage sales and many had put in their application for Friday and Saturday and obviously they were not open on Friday. So I even went to a church sale that it was their second day and nobody was there. I wasn't the only one cruising through and then turning back around. I found out later that they got stuck in traffic and, and nobody was there. So I missed out on that one. Here's what I got. I bought this cruet set for a dollar. This one came from the uh, thrift clearance center that's open twice a month and it's all a dollar, 50 cents, 25 cents on succeeding days. It's got this cubist kind of pattern. Uh, it looks like a pontal mark on the uh, bottom. I bought it for the stopper, but I think it's pretty on its own as well. I got this Mikasa set. I thought this was a serving set. I was in a hurry. I guess I just didn't pay attention. It is Summer Symphony. It says 20-piece place setting. There is only one place setting in here. <laughs> So I don't know what I'm going to do with this. Um, I wish I could just give it to one of you all who sells and you could just do your thing. But anyway, so I don't know what I'll do with that. <laughs> um, and then I got uh, to a garage sale that actually had some jewelry. They had a tub. I asked how much. They said a dollar a piece. Uh, at the end, I had collected 11 pieces and I asked if she would take less. And we decided on um, eight dollars for eleven pieces, so what's that's about seventy less than seventy five cents a piece. So I got these uh, first. I was hopeful that they would be gold. Um, so what they look like on the back? There's no mark. I've tested it. They're not gold, um, but I wear a lot of red and black in the winter, and I think those will be pretty. Um, I got these, which tested as ten karat gold, and little dangly earrings. They're not marked anywhere. So hopefully it's not gold filled and um, I'm just getting the scrapings from the first layer. But uh, either way, either myself or one of my nieces will wear them. I got these which tested, they are marked 14 karat, but there's no way you're going to be able to see it here on the back. It's right, I think right there. I'm going to try. I guess I shouldn't have said you're not going to be able to see it and then try to let you see it. But anyways, there they are. Uh, 14 karat what they tested as they were nice these are marked 925 and they test as 925 um, this pretty cross is marked 925 here at the top and it is well it is not zero it is slow is what it is I'll come back and show you I got these earrings these were very heavy um, um, and I didn't even realize they were marked, but I, I got them hoping that they would be sterling and they turned out to be sterling. So that's good. I'll show that for, to you. This was another hopeful. I have tested them over and over again. They are not sterling, but I'll hold on to them just in case I learn more later and I figure out if I'm doing something wrong. I also got this. It was marked Italy 925. It again has tested as not sterling multiple times. And um, let me show you. Finally, how much this cross weighs. The cross weighs 5.32. The earrings are better. They're right at 15 grams, even with that paper on there. And then I got these necklaces. So um, these are marked India uh, 925 on the chain. I haven't tested them, so it's iffy. This is kind of a, it's a stone, and it is a rust color. This is also a stone, and it is pink little facets on it and then the last is this um, jade this feels cold to the touch it has an old barrel clasp I can't find any markings on it anywhere but it's got the jade beads and um, I thought that was a pretty necklace that ought to be worth uh, what all I paid for it here for the eight dollars so I think I did okay I um, I hope that you'll be able to send me a comment, subscribe to my channel, and press like. Thanks so much, and see you next week.